And it's something that is a nice paper Mauricio Fava has done, arguing that we probably should look at it, do antidepressants and, and do antidepressants and placebo, and then do the uh, whatever the antidepressant is, giving now Trexone. Uh, because then you could probably ferret out what is the positive, you know, uh, expectation bias. But I think I think the that aspect uh, uh, will be advanced by ha having demonstrated not, not Trexone will blocks the ketamine thing. Ketamine still does bind weakly yeah. to the mu opioid receptor. It's micromolar, that is probably of some significance. Uh, and hope is not all of it, as I said to Jerry recently uh, at a meeting, uh, because the animals don't have any hope, right? They don't know what they're getting. They don't know what you're doing to them, and they don't have that prefrontal cortex development. Uh, and they show the same blockade of behavioral uh, uh, behavior. So uh, I think, you know, there'll be further work out there.